it means the world, um, to put it simply. But one thing that I've been returning to is the fact that I, I feel this recognition isn't just for you know my achievement in Power of the Dog alone, or even anything that that was a precursor to that. But also, you know, my personal life and any adversity that I've faced, and and with the team around me, pushed through to continue doing what I love, and to make it here today. So I mean, it's uh, yeah, it's it's a very heartfelt thing. Nice, that's great, that's great, awesome, awesome. I was already with my mum, my girlfriend, and my little brother, and I know my dad was watching somewhere. So um, I actually called Kirsten, I believe first. I called Kirsten, and we had a little celebration. And I asked where Jesse was, and he was on set, so I, I couldn't contact him till the next day. But um, yeah, it was my mother away from my mother. What little lady made these? Actually, I did, sir. My mother was a florist, so I made them to look like the ones in our garden. Oh, well, do pardon me. To be completely honest, the thing that I really loved about um, um, Peter in terms of his challenges is his challenges were mainly being an internalized being and uh, leaving hints but not revealing the twist of the movie and the motive of, of the character. But I was really happy that there was no scene that I was anxious to do, you know, whether it was a performative like crying scene or a raging angry one or swimming naked in ice cold water, which has actually happened a lot. So there was none of that and um, I loved that. It was really, you know, he's very quite monotone, if I may say that, and, it, and it's your perspective of him that dances around him and that's what tells his story so it was a cruise for me in many ways in that sense.